Hi, hey there everybody. So it's, I'm Crystal and uh, this is my first vlog. Um, I'm calling myself the reluctant vlogger because I am doing this reluctantly. Um, if uh, those of you who watch Tommy NC 2010, uh, he and I are good friends and he's been bugging me to start start vlogging and he and uh, apparently other people uh, think that I, I should, so that's a good enough reason for me. Um, I, uh, I'm not against it or anything. It's hardly something to be against, but uh, I'm not. I, I find that it's, it's odd sometimes vlogging. Uh, I, I don't feel like I, I really have much of great interest to say, but I'll do my best. Uh, Tommy and I and uh, Hamza um, spent a good part of the day together and we had a, a portrait made <laughs> as uh, Tommy had a, a coupon through Picture People and uh, he wanted it to be the three of us and um, so so this is the one that Tommy chose for the sheet. There we are. Um, what's really funny about this picture is you'll see the, the, the tripod there, uh, the, the fourth wheel. He doesn't say much. Uh, but yeah, he, he came along, uh, he's kind of attached, attached to Tommy's hip, but, um, yeah, it was, a, it was, it was, it was a fun time. It was a fun, it was hilarious. Uh, and we had a, well, another picture that I was particularly fond of. Um, Tommy had brought three, <laughs> three guns as, as props. Um, and, uh, we had Hamza on the, on the ground, leaning up, pointing a gun at, at Tommy. Tommy was standing pointing a gun at Hamza, and I was standing leaning back pointing a, a, a gun at, uh, at Tommy. It was very, it was very gangster. It was very gangster. Um, but yeah, that was, uh, and, I, and I also proceeded to eat Chinese food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner today, which is something that I never do, and now I, I know why. I, I feel like someone's dropped a, a lead weight in my gut. <laughs> but um, yeah, so, um, I, I think that something cool to do in a vlog would be, um, you know, maybe talk about some world events, uh, something, things that are happening in other places, um, rather than just what I do. I, um, I'm not, I'm not special. I'm not, but, um, so my boyfriend Aaron has a news app on his iPhone and he gets this update today about, um, uh, this, this thing that happened in Brazil. And so, you know, most of the rest of the world's crazy about soccer. And uh, apparently, very crazy, uh, more crazy than I would imagine, uh, because a referee got into a fight with a, with an athlete, with a player, and um, the I guess it got pretty heated because the referee um, stabbed the the player twice. Um, they rushed the player to the hospital. He actually died before he got there. So the family and friends of this player um, came back to where the ref was, um, still at, at the soccer field. And uh, proceeded to stone him to death, um, and dismembered his body, and took his head and put it on the end of a stick and stuck it in the middle of the of the soccer field. That's a, I mean, right? Like crazy fucked up world we live in. Not that you didn't already know that, but um, yeah. So apparently, apparently the the authorities there are still looking for the people that were involved and horrendously murdering this referee um so i don't know what's going to happen there but it, it was relatively i mean it was, it was it was shocking you know i mean i i can't say that much is really shocking anymore because you know you just you, you hear about the craziest stuff that that really does happen um but i i do i never cease to be amazed at at the things that go on Especially in other parts of the world, you know, nothing ever happens to me. I, my life is drama free. It's problem free. Um, I think that if you know an angel descended from heaven and said, "Hey, do you know that you're the luckiest person in the world?" I'd be like, "Yeah, I'm not surprised because I just, I just don't know what, I don't, I don't know what problems are about. I don't think most of us do really." Um, but yeah, so I, I, I'm just sitting here in this very rainy evening, drinking a Yingling black and tan out of a glass bottle. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Smoking my American spirit. And I have a, yeah, I'm a girl with lots of vices. But, um, <laughs> yeah, whatever. So I'll take a moment to 
to let you take a look see. Yeah, this has the, been the weather for about a week in Asheville, North Carolina. And it's just been raining constantly, almost constantly, for, for about a week. It's very, very soggy, very, very wet. We had some flash flooding. Um, yeah, it's just been no good. It's just been no good. It's not really raining that hard right now, so I'll take a walk outside before it gets too dark. And uh, there's my grandmother's beautiful azalea bush. It's so big. It's kind of heavy right now. But uh, yeah, so we live, we live up there. It's my grandmother's, my grandparents' house. And they live right down there. That's their window. Um, it's really nice. It's a really nice place. Here's the the garage and the shop. This shop right here, my uh, my uncle and my father and my grandfather built with their hands. And uh, there's the porch and there's the bar dog barking. You can see I'm getting some getting some rain on my. And then here's my grandmother's um, extensive flower collection. <laughs> she has spent many years developing this garden that is just extraordinary. Um, actually we have people from around the around the neighborhood, around the community that come and uh, actually take pictures of, of these of her flowers because they're so nice. Of course my grandfather did all the work. <laughs> she didn't do any of the work. She just did the purchasing and the planning but uh, <laughs> but still it's pretty nice. Um, so yeah, I guess that about wraps it up for my first my first vlog there. <laughs> um, so yeah, I am uh, I'm Crystal, the reluctant vlogger, and uh, I'll catch you next time.